welcome back to my channel for those of you who are new here to my channel hello my name is Angeles and hopefully you guys subscribe to become part of the family here on YouTube and for those of you who are my long-term subscribers hello guys welcome back I know I've been gone for a minute and I am back today to do a try on haul slash first impressions on the Aliexpress faux mink lashes for up to three dollars so that is what we're gonna be doing today in today's video it's exciting i actually have four pairs for you guys and i did get multiple of each um lash so we are gonna be trying on lashes today about a couple weeks ago i did post a picture on my instagram if i can i'll go ahead and post it right here on the screen um but i did get a lot of dms asking what lashes i was wearing where they were from and i did answer to all the dms that i did get and no shame in my game i let them know they were aliexpress and a lot of them were really surprised and the people who asked me in person as well tend to go ooh once I tell them that it's from Aliexpress but honestly I have nothing but good things to say about the lashes the only thing that I would have to say that would be bad would be the shipping depending on the seller that you do buy from um, the shipping could be really quick or the shipping could be very 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 long if you're not familiar with Aliexpress it's big sellers that would sell things for cheap prices um, sometimes they sell things in bulk for a better price and most of the sellers are from China um, you can find hair nails eyelash extensions eyelash strips you can find a bunch of things the first time that I did purchase from Aliexpress the lashes did come from one seller I purchased all my lashes from just one seller and it did take about a month for the lashes to get to me I had actually forgot that I had ordered lashes the second time around that I purchased I purchased from the same seller and the lashes came within two weeks which was really sh fast shipping compared to the last time that I ordered I got a lot of the same styles the first one that I want to go ahead and show you guys is this one it's the D808 the packaging is cute it's cheaply made though which um it's fine okay so now i'm gonna go ahead and try these on these are the d808 lashes the one thing i do have to say about these lashes is that if you have eyes sort of like mine short in like length i guess you can say if it's the right way to say it these eyelashes are gonna be very long for you so i always like to go ahead and measure them up to my eye these seem to be a little bit long typically when i cut my lash band since it is a little bit larger than my eye a little wider i like to go ahead and cut off the last piece where you see that space just because that would be enough for it to fit my eye now what i would suggest is that when you are cutting your band if it is that you need to cut your band i would suggest getting some scissors that are actually really good at cutting the scissors that i'm using right now are not the ones that i would typically use for some reason someone loves to go ahead and take the good scissors that i have to do i don't know what with them so they are not in my position right now but this is what i would typically do i would just cut off the very ends of it like that and i am stuck with a band that looks like this that will now fit my eye perfectly yeah. So this is what the lashes look like when they are put on and they've been trimmed. Remember, this is D808, so I'm actually going to zoom you guys in so you guys can see what these lashes look like up close. Super cute. But these are the lashes that I was most excited about. These are D22, which look like this. If it can focus. So just like we did with the last lash, I'm going to go ahead and cut these. As you guys can see, these are a little bit different than the last one. They do have spacing in between, but they are more fluffy. So now I have them out of the package. Um, the first thing that you do notice is that they are very flexible the band is thick but it's still very flexible unlike the other one the other one the band was thick but it wasn't as i wasn't able to move the band like how i could do this one okay so the ones that i have on right now are currently the d22s this is what they look like i'm actually going to zoom you guys in so you guys can see how fluffy they really are
They're super fluffy like I mentioned. Like they're super fluffy and super lightweight. Which is nice. Really nice. So. so the next one that we have is the 09. Which looks... Papi, I need you to be quiet, okay? Again, for this eyelash, um, it doesn't come with left or right. So I guess whichever eye you want to go ahead and put it on, that's the eye it's going to go on. All right, so these are the D809s. As you can tell, hopefully, these are less dramatic, in my opinion, than the two previous ones that we've tried on. They're fairly easy to put on, actually really easy to put on. I can feel the lash band on this one um, compared to the D22, the last ones. These are really nice though, but the only thing that I do not like about these lashes are the ends to the left of my eye. They're not as full as the, le the, the ends of my right eye, so I do have to see. It, that, that personally bothers me, but other than that, it's nothing too much. So I'm going to zoom you guys in. So you guys can see the full effect of these eyelashes. I really do like them though. So the next ones we have are D813, which look just like this. As you guys can tell, these eyelashes do go from being really small and thin from the inner and then throughout the lash band towards the end they do get longer so i'm gonna go ahead and see what these lashes look like and to me first glance they don't look as long as the other ones but i'm gonna go ahead and test it out so the ones that i currently have on are the da13s which are the most natural looking ones of them all i think you can agree to that as well so with that being said they're not my favorite ones <laughs> Sorry, they're not my favorite ones. <laughs> they are not my favorite ones just because they don't give me more of that cat eye. Well, in my opinion, they don't give me more of that dramatic cat eye look. D813. They're really cute. They're really good if you want more of the natural looking ones but are still a little long and a little bit dramatic. More dramatic than the actual natural lashes. <coughs> Sorry, I'm a little sick. Um, But... These are cute. These are cute. Don't get me wrong. I wouldn't necessarily wear them just because to me they won't give me any more of that extra look. But if I had to just wear and choose natural eyelash with no makeup, it would be these. Hey guys, so that is it for today's video. I hopefully, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I had four lashes. As you guys already saw, I did um, buy multiple of those lashes. So they are my go-to the ones that i always go ahead and pick up no matter what it is it's the d08 and the d22s um those are my go-to lashes the other ones i purchased just to go ahead and try on for you guys and to let you guys know that there is multiple options out there and there are multiple sellers as well you just got to go ahead and pick which one you guys like it's trial and error so that is it for me guys hopefully you guys enjoyed this and i will see you guys in my next video